Hey guys, I'm going to quickly show you how you can export uh, either a PDF or a PNG from SketchUp Free. Now, the first thing you want to do is basically position your camera where you want to export the, the PDF or PNG from. So for this, I'm just going to hide a few of these walls so I can see inside uh, my home office that I designed. So I'm just going to hide these pictures quickly. And then I'm going to pick a viewpoint like here. And then what I can do is I just come to the menu on the left hand side and come down to print. Now here you can see in the top right hand corner you'll be able to select what size of paper you'd like to uh, export as. So this is going to be in your PDF so you can go A4, A3, A2, basically all, all, the, all the main sizes. You can also change uh, between portrait and landscape which is really cool, very useful. And also if you've got any scenes that you've made within your model you can actually just click on them and it will basically position your camera from your, your scenes which is also very handy. You can also adjust the size of the paper, so I'm pretty sure you can create a custom one if you wanted to. And you can either select white background or not. Um, I think this basically means that um, if you had any background image, you could, you could then make it white, essentially. And then from here, you just click print PDF, and it will just tell you that it's going to open it in your favorite PDF viewer. And then once you click OK, it may take a few seconds, but then you should hopefully have a PDF downloaded um, that you can then open. Okay, so the PDF just downloaded, so if I just click on this, um, it will open up in, in the print window, but I can cancel that. And you can see I have the PDF, um, so from here I could basically send this to you know, anyone via email or, or anything like that. Uh, unfortunately, there's a little SketchUp watermark in the top right hand corner, but there's not much we can do about that. I mean, you could edit it out in you know, Photoshop or something like that. So what we're going to do to get our PNG is come down to download and just click PNG. And again, we'll have pretty much uh, similar options to the PDF export, except now we have these kind of views, which is really helpful. So you can actually just click on uh, these certain viewpoints to get, you know, quickly find um, a point of view that might be useful to you. Again, you can also pick a scene, but I'm just going to leave it as, as we had it. So something like that would be fine. And then you can put transparent background on as well. So that's really good. You know, obviously for a PNG, you're going to have um, yeah, transparent background so you can use these images over the top of other images, uh, lots of things like that. So again, I'm just going to click export PNG. Um, it's going to take a bit longer depending on the size. You can adjust the sizes as well. So if you've got a particular size you want to do, you just adjust them at uh, either this point or this point. So now you'll see our PNG is downloaded in the bottom left hand corner. So I can click on that, open that up and now I use that image for anything I want. So there are some other options to export in SketchUp Free. You have all your standard 3D and 2D file types, but unfortunately these are not av available in the free version of SketchUp. You're going to need the full version to export in any of these formats. So hopefully that's helped you. If you want to know how I designed and built this office, I have a full lesson of me uh, creating this on my Skillshare. So if you use the link below, you'll get one month free and you can check out this lesson. It's really cool. This is my uh, home office. So I'm pretty happy with it. Um, but apart from that, I hope you enjoyed this and if you've got any questions or comments, please let me know and I'll see you in the next video.